What's going on y'all, it's your boy Michael Watu, leader of the Duelist Club, and today, hopefully, if everything works out the way I want it to, this will be the third video up today. Um, this is just going to be a dinosaur combo video or combo tutorial, um, just in case you don't know how the deck works. And um, I'm doing this one because I think the guy's name's Danny Folds. I'll put his video, not his video, but his um, his YouTube channel up as, I guess, a uh, shout out. Um, he had, he had, he caught me slipping. I said that in the last dino video that um, I would do a uh, combo tutorial if he made it past 100 likes, and we did. Did not know that that happened, so um, I'm going to make it up for him and um, to everybody else who also watched that video. So yeah, um, without any further ado, let's get into it. All right, guys. So for the first combo, you're gonna need a way to get to um, Solidian Gobi Raptor and an Effect Veiler. You know what I'm saying? You might want to use Fossil Dig, and let's just say you have it like this, right? So let's go ahead with the combo. Um, it's a safe combo. I want to say one of the, in terms of how efficient it is, I think this one is the least efficient. That doesn't mean that it's not efficient. That just means there's other combos out there that are a lot better. But this is just in case. This is all you can do. And you know, Fossil Dig, Fossil Dig to add um, Solidian Gobi Raptor to hand. Normal summon it. Um, Solating effect, send this one to graveyard um, from the, from the deck, right? And then you use over Texas effect to add um, double evolution pill. You add that to hand, and then you use evolution pill effect, banishing your non-dino and the dino. And then you can go into your deck and look for ultimate and other tyranno and um, special summon it onto the field. This is pretty good, especially because you still have three cards in your hand that can be used as fodder for. Um, Ultimate Kenneth the Tyranno. Hopefully you have a baby in your hand, because if so, this is a lot better. Because you can blow up the baby on your opponent's side of the field using Conductor's Effect, turn everything face down. Baby Effect, bring out another dino, and you can just do whatever you want. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, yeah, let's go into another combo. Alright guys, so we're going to do three more combos, and what we're going to do is, we're just going to shuffle up the deck, and then we're going to act as if we're going second, alright? And then, the hand that we have, we're just going to try to make a make a combo out of it. Now, we should be fine, because I don't really break with this deck. So, uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's go ahead and try it out. Alright, we're going to give it to our opponent. Opponent's going to cut us, alright? One, not bad. Two, three, four, five... So this already isn't all that bad. We have so many different plans we can go into and um, what we can actually do here is we can just go ahead and double evolution pill, banishing effect Veiler and giant Rex. We can just put this over here. Actually, no, we're going to put it right here as our graveyard and then we're going to banish them up here. There we go. So we're going to banish effect. This one comes back onto the field and then we can search our deck for a... Um, there we go. Search our deck right here for an ultimate connected Tyranno. We just brought this out. And then we can normal summon Solidian Ovi Raptor. Ovi Raptor effect. To go in here and to search for something, we're going to search for Miscellaneous Source. Bring it out here. Since it's still main phase one, we're going to send this one to grave and protect all of our dinos from activated card effects, which saves us from this. Um, for um, losing that, right? And then after doing that, we can pretty much just like go into like an XZ's if you want to. You can um, send this one to the banish zone and then bring out a level one, which that's probably what we're gonna end up doing actually. Let's do that. So we're gonna use um, miscellaneous effect. We're gonna banish one. And then you can bring out Drac Alio in defense position. And after sending it in there in defense position, you can go for one, two, three. Send in these three, and then you can go into your extra deck and look for Trish. I never really go into this combo, but it's a it's a combo that you can do. You can bring out Trish, use Trish effect to banish one card in their hand, one card in their field, and one card in their graveyard, just in case they have something crazy going on. And then you can use um, Ultimate Conductor's effect, destroy the baby in hand, turn everything face down, right? And then you can use Baby effect to come in here, and you can look for a, um, gosh, I looked in the wrong deck. You can come in here and you can look for another level 4 to bring out onto the field. Which probably won't be um, Solying, so you can possibly just bring out like a giant Rex or whatever to protect you. And um, there you go. I mean, you have, you have a, you know, 
a decent field. You really can't like stop any of their effects right now. Um, but it doesn't matter because on their turn, if they try anything, you can blow this one up and send everything face down. And if not, you do have Fossil Dig. You can send Fossil Dig to the graveyard, add baby to hand, end your turn, next turn they try something, blow up baby Cirrusaurus. And then you go in here and then you look for a Soliting Oviraptor. You summon it off and then you use Oviraptor's effect. And what you can do is you can add another Ultimate Connect to Tyranno because you do have other Dino Monsters in here. And you can just add this to hand, right? Your next turn, if you want to, you can send all three of these. Or, even better, you can just send these two. And then go into your extra deck, bring out Underclock Taker, and then use, um, bring out Ultimate um, Conductor Tyranno, banishing one and two. This comes back onto the field. You can bring out another Ultimate Conductor Tyranno. You can overlay, we never drew, but it's just that. And then you can overlay and go into anything. You know what I'm saying? You feel like they're gonna use monster effects, go into Dolka. Go into Lagi if you feel like they're gonna use, you know, spells and traps. They're doing something with their back, um, not their back row, but their um, graveyard, Abyss Dweller, you know what I'm saying? Um, anything in the back row, Tornado Dragon. But yeah, um, this is like a two turn combo, but the first one I showed you before going on to the next turn, that's the actual combo, that's what you end up on, and it's pretty good. Let's go on to our next combo. All right, guys, I spent about a good 20 seconds shuffling this up. I feel like this is good. Give it to our opponent. We're just going to go like this. We're just going to go like that. And there we go. We're going to draw one, two. That is already great. Three, really great. Four. This is broken. That's six. That's but This is busted. This is a busted hand. Now, what you can do is... Um, of course, to protect your dinos from dino um, from your opponent's activated effects, send Miscellaneousaurus to grave. You know, so now they can't ash you or ogre your dinosaurs. Now they can hit everything else that's not a dinosaur, but everything that is a dinosaur, you know, what I'm saying it's protected. So what you can do is you bring out um, Baby Cirrusaurus, right? Uninterrupt the Kaiju Slumber. You blow up their field. You blow up your field. And before we even do that, let's go ahead and grab out our um, Kaiju's. Just so we don't forget, because I have forgotten to do this one time, and a guy never told me, and I, I it was it was a loss. I was really nervous. It was my first, you know, um, regional, and he didn't say nothing. So I mean, I don't blame him. He wanted to win, and I wanted to win. So whatever. But you know, there we go. We have two kaiju's on the field. We have a baby who just got destroyed. Then you use baby's effect to come out here. You bring out ultimate, uh, not ultimate, but a uh, soul eating over after. And then let's see, what do we have in hand right now? They're all dinosaurs, so it it would not help us right now to um you know, go, um, look for um, overtext and the send it to grave. So what we can do is being that we know that there's an ultimate connected Tyranno in our hand, we can go ahead and look for giant Rex, send it to grave, and then we can use giant Rex and baby Cirrusaurus, banish both um, giant Rex effects to bring this out into the field. And then we can go and look for an ultimate conductor Tyranno, bring this out onto the field, and then we can go into miscellaneous source effects. Sending that, and this is if you want to do so, but I'm pretty sure this is game if I do it this way. Bring out um, Drek Alio. And off of Drek Alio, we're just gonna go ahead and um, we're gonna synchro these two out. And then we're gonna go into, if I can find them, Chambara. Bring this out right here. This is middle. And then after doing that, we have a Regeki in hand, so we don't have to swing over this card. So what we can do is Regeki, um, blow this card up. And now you have 35, 3,000, 1,800, and 42 because it attacks twice. And that, that's, that's game. Look at that. We out here doing work out here. All right, guys, we're doing our third combo. We're going ahead and, you know, shuffling this up. Gotta make sure I get the entire top so you guys know I ain't stacking. And I'm being honest, yo, that second one, I ain't stacked nothing, yo. I feel like I shouldn't even bring it up, but like, that was nutty. Like, that's that's the Forsaken combo, yo. I was about to put that combo itself into the uh, combo thing before I, you know, I shuffled up, but I was like, nah, forget it. We'll just hope for the best. But here we go, shuffled it up, give it to your opponent, opponent cuts, one, 
Okay, two. What the heck, man? Three. This is three of the six we just got. Four. Five. This is so nutty. All right, guys, let's just go ahead and play Lost World. Now, look at this hand. I don't think we can actually make game with it. I'm thinking about it. Um, let's see. It looks like we can, though. Let me try it. Um, double evolution pill. Banishing these two. Looking into the deck for an ultimate conductor Tyranno. Got that. I said ultimate conductor like super weird. My B. Um, we're going to bring that one out. And then due to that, we're going to give them a direct egg. Then we're going to blow up the field with uninterrupted Kaiju Slumber. Of course. And then after blowing up the field, they're going to get one. And we are going to get one. And then this dies, and this one's protected, of course. And by protecting it, we're going to pitch Baby Sarasaurus. And then we're going to use Baby Sarasaurus' effect to bring out Soliding Oviraptor. And then we're going to use Oviraptor's effect to add um, Ultimate Conductor Tyranno to the hand. After doing so, we're going to banish off one, two. Bring out Ultimate Conductor Tyranno, Regeki. Yeah, that's game. I don't know why I was thinking that it was gonna be game. Yeah, that's uh yeah, that's super game. That that's that's uh that's all folks. Alright guys, so um this is going to be our fourth combo. Um how much time do I got? Yeah, I got a lot of time. Um I might do this one. This one might be the last one, but if you look at the timestamp and it's longer, then never mind. Um, so let's go ahead. Oh, well, no, no, I'm not drawing that one next turn. Now it's all the way at the bottom. Now it's in the middle. Now it's at the bottom. Top, bottom. And then we're going to do this. And just because I know where it is, we're going to do that. There we go. And then give it to our opponent. Do that. Going second, of course. We're redoing that. We're not gonna get, no, we're not doing that another one of these. <laughs> I keep freaking drawing into that card. There we go, cut it. Let's see what we get now. All right, not bad. Okay, that's already Ultimate Conductor. All right, that's, that's, that's not, that's actually not bad. All right, guys, looking, um, I mean, we do have a brick, but that's okay because we can use it as a fodder for the combo. So let's uh, let's go ahead and do so. Um, you can use Solidity Ovi Raptor, and then of course we can just go into the uh, generic combo that I showed you at the beginning by uh, looking for if we can find it. Him, pitch him. We get double evolution pill, and then we can use double evolution pill effect to go into some other stuff. Double. Banishing off one and we can do two. Banishing off these two to look in here for another ultimate connect to Tyranno. Here it is. We're going to bring that one out. After bringing this one out, we're just going to go ahead and. Hmm. What can we do? Fossil dig. Then we're gonna use Fossil Dig. I wanna put that right there, my bad. We're gonna use Fossil Dig, bring out a baby Ceratosaurus, and we're gonna pretend there's some monsters on the side of the field because we know that there probably is. Effect, pop baby, turn everything face down. Let's just say there's like one monster on our side of the field. We turn it face down and use baby Ceratosaurus effect. We'll bring out Giant Rex. We can do that, right? Yeah. Yeah, we can do that. We're bringing out Giant Rex, and then we can overlay into Samurai, if I can find him. Boom. And then he can just attack that one for a thousand, or we can just do this. Swing at it for 19, and then discard. Swing again for 19, and then we can swing for 35. And there we go. We got, we got some damage, but I mean, you can go into anything you want right here. So if you don't think you can end the game, Easily, you can just kind of overlay and go into something else that can protect you later. 
Um, but other than that, you know what I'm saying? We, we did our job. We, we made a we made a field, I guess. All right, guys. After the way the fourth one ended, we're just going to go ahead and try to do one more. And, you know, see if we can make, like, an actual, like, super big field. And if not a big field, just a way to just end the game. Like I said, we're going to keep going second. This is a going second deck. So, yeah, let's, let's see what we get. We're going to do that. And then we're going to do this. And let's go. One two three that's already ultimate conductor by the way four five oh, okay we have him again six so this still is not bad all right guys so let's go ahead and uh make our board we're going to start off with soul eating over raptor and off of that we're going to play double evolution pill off of double evolution pill we're going to search for giant rex and we can either add it to the hand or onto the field honestly it's um your call, but we're just going to add it to the hand for this one, and we're going to banish these two. After banishing, of course, this one comes back out onto the field, and then we can special summon one ultimate conductor Tyranno onto the field. Then we're going to use Tyranno effect, popping baby Cerasaurus, and we're going to send everything face down, and then we're going to use baby Cerasaurus effect to bring out another baby Cerasaurus. Then we're going to use Soul Eating. Pop this, bring this back, and we're gonna look for another level four to special summon. If I can find them, yes, miscellaneous source. And after making these three, we're gonna get rid of these. We're gonna link three. After linking three, we're gonna go in for a decode because we have yet to make decode. I just realized that. So we just made decode. All right, and he's already face down still, so we're all good. And what we can do here is banishing off one, two, three, four. To look for another level four. What do we have left in our hand? That's good for next turn if we make it next turn. And we can go in here and look for another level four to bring out onto the field. Which will probably just be Giant Rex because we know he's going to be gone again next turn. And we're, what we're going to do is we're probably just going to have Giant Rex swing over. We're gonna swing in our turn, and being that they're gonna survive, next turn, they're gonna try to do something, of course. Pop the baby, turn everything face down. Baby effect, of course, we can go in here, look for a soul eating over after effect on their turn. Um, bring it onto the field. Soul eating effect, we can go in here and look for another ultimate conductor Tyranno. Put it right here. And then, yeah, um, our turn, we're gonna draw. And that is going to be game because that is terraforming and in terraforming it's going to allow us to just go completely nuts getting us our lost world and then we're going to normal summon soul eating over raptor and then we're going to use over raptors effect and lost world effect to give them a token by the way and we're going to put that token right above here and we're going to what we're going to search for what we're going to search for honestly I think we can actually get out yeah, yeah, we yep, yeah, yeah, we can actually. No, we can't. We're just gonna go ahead and be like this, and we can just make whatever we really want to. Um, I don't know really what I really don't know what to search with. Um, soul eating. Um, I guess we can just search in just whatever we need. So we could add overtext to our field or whatever, because I can see what we can do with that. So we add overtext to field, not the field but the hand, of course. And then what we're gonna do is we're probably just gonna overlay. Just in case they got any hand traps, we're probably just gonna go ahead and make Lagia. Or you can make Tornado Dragon hit their back row. We're just gonna stick with Lagia for this um, example though. We're gonna use Lagia, say they do something. Lagia effect, get rid of those two, negate. Then now that they have been negated, we can banish off these two. Banish, this one hits the field, and then we can make this guy. Then we can overlay again go into whatever we want um let's just say castell then we use castell effect discard two stop their stuff how many we got in here one two three four we got exactly six cards in here so we can send five back to the deck to bring out over text which is what i brought out in the uh the let's play not the let's play but the uh the deck list we're gonna send these five back 
And then we can actually use his effect, which his effect states that um, I can destroy one monster in my hand or face up on the field. And if I do, I can get an activation and destroy it. So it's really good if you can get it out. And this is turn two. So this is not bad at all. We just freaking swarmed the field. And now we have overtext in here. And, you know, if we need to destroy something, we're probably going to destroy this. And then we can destroy these two for other things. And, we, you know, of course, we can use that. Get rid of the face downs and just swing for game. Um, so this took two turns to do. Um, the other ones took um, around just one turn. So, uh, yeah, um, let me know if this was helpful. Um, I felt like um, if I did it with um, actual, like, hands, it would be a lot better. Um, but if it wasn't, just let me know, but I can just easily make a new one and just do, like, actual just staple combos. Um, so yeah, don't forget to like, favorite, and subscribe. I'm a love a new digit to the Duelist Club, and I hope you like this three video week. And I'll see you guys later.